Hey guys, welcome back. My name is Ali Afinu and welcome to Beauty with a Purpose. If you are new to my channel, my name is Ali. I upload three videos a week, beauty, Bible, and lifestyle. So if any of those interest you, please go ahead and hit that subscribe button and let's get into today's video. All right, you guys. So getting into today's video, first of all, I have you for you guys my August favorites. And I cannot be the only one who cannot believe that we are already in September. Like three more months and this year is over. I feel like... I don't know if it's because there's been so much chaos and ruckus going on this year, like in the media and all that jazz, not in my own life, but just out in the world. And it's just making, I mean, the Bible does speak that days will just fly by, but I mean like, dang, like the days are really just flying by. Like, wow. But um, the Lord's will be done. Let's go ahead and get into my August beauty and lifestyle favorites. Um, I don't have, I'm gonna go ahead and tell you guys right now, I don't have any new songs or um, shows for the month of August. I was kind of just jamming and listening to the same things. Cause like I said, last month's songs were songs that were really just correcting my heart and filling up my heart. And so I kind of just dwelled there for the rest of August. And so we were loving those songs. If you don't know what songs I'm talking about, check out my last month's favorites they're at the very end of the video so you could just kind of fast forward so you start to see apple music screenshots pop up on the screen and yeah so let's go ahead and get into today's video we are going to start with makeup and i actually don't have a lot of favorites a lot of it are just things that i fell back in love with because i haven't really bought excuse me up until today i hadn't bought any new makeup to try so yeah, so the first thing we're going to get into is foundation. So I had made myself stop using this Rare Beauty. Ugh, and I have the shade 250W. So I have actually, I made myself stop using this foundation because in May, like in April and May, I mean, your girl was going ham sandwich on this foundation. And I was like, you know what, Allie? Like, well, for one, I had to stop using it because I had got too dark. But now my tan is kind of fading. We're getting back to like light medium biscuit so i was able to start using this one again and it matches me perfectly like it was a tiny bit too dark before but now it matches me perfectly and so i've really been loving this again again it's what i have on today and i just forgot how much i loved this how easy it is to build up how you know like convenient it having a wand is and like i just oh my gosh like no y'all better not let me get into the point where this is the only foundation i pick up again D don't let me get back to that point but you know we're gonna love on her a little bit longer but what i have actually been loving in combination with this is the hello fab coconut skin smoothie priming priming moisturizer okay so my skin's kind of been freaking out because i've been out of my hyaluronic acid for a while so i've been using this one i have to say at times i like this one more than i like my smashbox primerizer primer because this one does a really 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 good job at blurring and minimizing your pores i don't know and this one adds like a super healthy glow to the skin as well so i don't know that's why i really like this one it adds like that glow it does a great job of minimizing and blurring pores that this one is just like that great like i i like this one and so if you're curious as to what it looks like it kind of has like that um like it has like a tint to it now it doesn't stay on your face it Smells really good too. It kind of smells almost exactly like the Smashbox Primerizer. And like I said, it just adds a really pretty glow. And again, it's hydrating, it's a moisturizer. And I do agree with that, but I like it because it's not too heavy for underneath your makeup and it just makes your makeup look so freaking beautiful. Just kidding guys, I can really sing. Okay, this is on its last leg. Like I am about to have to pull out this stopper thing here and get the last of the powder out of there. I just bought a backup of this because I forgot how pretty this powder was that in August, I was tearing this bad boy up. I have literally been saving that last little bit of powder that I have in there because I just forgot how good it is. And it's a very affordable. I believe that this is only like eight bucks and it's a super good powder. I have high-end powders that don't amount to this one and i love it because even though it says glow it gives you more of a 
satin finish rather than a glowy finish. So it'll kind of keep you matte. It'll keep your oils at bay, but you don't look flat, if that makes sense. So yeah, super duper love this one. Okay, some lashes that I fell in love with in August, and I couldn't stop using them. I love these for every day. And once they go on sale at the Ulta 21 Day of Beauty sale, because I'm pretty sure that these are only gonna be $6, I'm buying like five pairs. Yes, your girl is gonna spend $30 on lashes, because y'all, I love these House of Lashes Iconic Light Lashes. These are so pretty for every day. They just make your lashes ba va boom. They also look natural-ish but they're like not too much. I don't know, like I just love these. I believe I'm wearing them in my last couple of videos from last week. And these, ah, I, whenever I rewatched those videos and I was editing, I was like, man, what lashes am I wearing? And then I remembered it was these lashes. And I just love these lashes and the way that they look. They're easy to apply. They stay on all day. And yeah, your girl needs some more. So I'm so excited that these, that these are going to be a part of Ulta's 21 Days of Beauty sale. So yeah get them i believe it's oh, my phone's all the way back there i'll leave on the screen whenever these will be on sale hopefully i upload before these go on sale hopefully hopefully okay so i bought the kiss lash adhesive whenever i believe i went to abilene with raquel because i forgot to take a lash glue i can't remember when i bought it and i was trying to use that and i was trying to love it because i was like i used to like it and everybody keeps raving about it and i'm like i don't know i just don't like it anymore and i've had this velour lashes one as you can see this one is well well very well loved and so i was gonna i tried to buy a new one today but my ulta was all out of the lash glue so i may have to order it online but this velour lash glue in the white tube absolutely love it you don't have to wait forever for it to dry on the lash you got to wait like maybe 10 to 20 seconds and then stick it on and it is going to stick it lasts all day i cry with this lash glue on and my lashes don't go anywhere the only time that i have a problem with this lash glue is user error by not sticking my lashes on the thing right but i this is what i'm using today for my lashes and i mean they on there they on there y'all they on there it's a really good lash glue it's 12 bucks if you want to splurge on a lash glue, splurge on this one. I really, really like that. Okay, so a mascara that I fell back in love with too was, I just recently did a declutter. That video is up already on my channel as well from last week, so go check that one out. Um, but the L'Oreal Air Volume Mascara, I fell back in love with it, and I did a declutter, and I found this one again, and I was like, oh, I have that one. I loved that one before I got my Revlon one. And you guys, I used this. I'll, I'll just have to use this again in a video and show you guys just why I love it so much But uh, it, it makes them so fluffy, but it also lengthens but the fluffiness like I just cannot Get over the fluffiness that this does for your lashes and it doesn't flake y'all know my pet peeve with mascaras is flaking I don't care if you smudge a little bit, but don't flake all over my face like I have the L'Oreal at the Bambi eye the new one on my lower lash one lash line and that one flakes a lot and so I don't know maybe I might get rid of that one but yeah this one is so good highly recommend it another thing is that I have fallen in love with instead of using a brow pomade which I had fallen in love with and back in love with in July but in August I started using my NYX um, lift and snatch brow pen again I just love how these make your eyelashes look like you have a million bajillion hairs. That's what I love about this brow pen, and that's all I have to say about it. If you wanna look like you have a million bajillion brow hairs, use this brow pen. Now be careful, because it's like whenever you first start, it's not as pigmented, but the more you use it, it gets super pigmented. So just use a light hand the entire time, and then go back over the parts where it wasn't coming out as pigmented. I also lo have learned that shaking it first gets the tip really really wet for you to be able to go in there and do that and that is it for beauty you guys or not really i guess skin care skin care considered a beauty i don't know but i received this in one of my box like in my last boxy charm that i got that's the pharmacy honey girl um honey girl ultra hydrating face oil 
I love this. At first, I thought it was breaking me out. So at first, I thought it was breaking me out. It was not this that was breaking me out. And I've been rubbing this in my eyebrows. And I feel like it's making my eyebrows grow too. So it's like an all-in-one, super hydrating. And even though it says honey, it smells like honey. It's thick, but it absorbs really, really fast into the skin, which is something that I like. Because a lot of the time, some of them thicker oils just kind of sit on the skin. And I don't like that feeling because if I'm doing my nighttime skincare routine, I mean, I'm getting in the bed right afterwards. I don't want oil just slipping and sliding all over my pillowcases so I really like that this one like within 30 seconds to a minute it, it's fully absorbed into your skin and I really really like that for that okay so this next item I received in an influencer box because this is a $240 perfume y'all and I didn't know that till I had to do like my little campaign things for influencer now it looks like I haven't used it but now let me tell you why you don't need very much of this for it to be strong I literally do and I'm good all day long. And I mean, I'm smelling this all day freaking long. There's a sweater that I wore on a date night and it still smells like this. And I, we went on date like two weeks ago. Two weeks ago we went on a date and my sweater still smells like this. What the what? Like this lasts forever and it smells so good and it's very, it's like that perfect in between of, I'm not a teeny bopper, but I'm not real musky mature it's like the perfect in between like that's the best way i can say because it has like a little bit of fruitiness but then it has that little bit of sweet musk but not very much musk it's more sweet rather than musky and so that's why i say it's the perfect definitely for like somebody my age who's 28 like this is perfect because it's not too mature like 40 plus or 50 plus i don't know like 50 plus but it's definitely like late 20s late 30s age range i feel like y'all would love this so yeah it's so mm, so sweet it smells delicious like literally rolling in love perfect name for it because brian really brian brian be want to roll in my love when i wear this <laughs> i'm so childish don't mind me don't mind me really like this perfume 240 dollars. i'm so thankful i got that for free because i would have never bought that okay so getting into some like beverages which is kind of like lifestyle okay so the first thing i want to talk about and it's only because my mouth is getting dry are these ramune um drinks i've tried strawberry i've tried hibiscus i've tried the melon and there's been a few other ones that i've tried these are so good now i buy these from our asian food mart and they're like a six pack for like 10 bucks so they're really expensive but they are so good Like they have no artificial color, naturally flavored, made with real sugar. They're so good, so good, so good. And I don't believe that these have caffeine either. Yeah, I think these are caffeine free, but they're like soda. I don't know, these are so good. Try these out, look for them around you. Yeah, I promise you'll like these and they're only 100 calories for this whole bottle. So yeah, okay, and then the next one is, you guys know, I have been loving my teas. I have been using my teas as medicine lately. And you guys know I was in love with the traditional medicinals nighty night tea. And I even tried the nighty night extra. I, I feel like it's as good as the nighty night. But this right here, this one right here, this sleepy time extra by sleepy time. Y'all, y'all don't play with this tea. Cause you're gonna drink this. If you're gonna drink this tea, be in the bed with your cup of tea. Be in the bed with your cup of tea. Cause if not, you're gonna be somewhere laid out. Cause this really helps. So if you have trouble with insomnia and trouble just feeling restless, or you feel like you need a nap, but you just can't fall asleep, try this tea. Try this tea. Okay, and last but not least, I really wanted to talk not about one specifically, but more about a company. And this is from the Daily Grace Company. And I love them. They have all things Bible study. They have actual literal Bible studies, Bibles, journals. They have highlighters that are made for your Bibles. They have the Bible tabs. They have so many things, you guys, for Bible study. And it makes it interesting, like, just to, like, you know, make everything girly and pretty. So check out the Daily Grace Company. But I really love their Bible studies. Like, first of all, they're aesthetically pleasing to look at. I really recommend this one for beginners. Search the word. It just kind of 
helps you rely on the word but they also have like studies by individual books so i have the two on romans because it's like the first part of romans the second part of romans and then i have colossians and this one's called rooted in him and then romans is called the gospel of grace and then the gospel centered life and then again search the word and this is just knowing and loving god through intentional bible study the best, I, I promise you, if you go on their website, like you are going to find the perfect Bible study for you. And the best part is they always have a sale. Always have a sale. I get their emails all the time and they always have a sale. Like right now, like, like they always have like a 50% off sale. So like I got these, I got these Bible studies for like five bucks, five bucks. You know how much a Bible study is at Mardell's? better get on the daily grace and i'll buy bibles from Mardell's because you get 30 percent off a one full priced item but bible studies you better hit up the daily grace company y'all it's actually called daily grace co but we all know that co period is for company so yeah but anyways those are all the things that i've been loving in august you guys get you some bible study oh no hold up hold up almost forgot to talk about this beauty oh my gosh Look at this. You know how long I've been trying to get a poofy ponytail back here? And either it's just dry poof or it's freaking, freaking weighed down too heavy by hair product. <gasps> Y'all, this Aunt Jackie's Curls and Coils Coconut Cream Recipes Curl Boss Coconut Curl. Oh, can't even talk. Coconut Curling Gel. Y'all, this is the one. This is the one. I found mine at Target. It's only six bucks. And y'all, it smells divine. Picked it. That's all I'm going to say about this. Like, look at that. You don't want this volume? I should have worn my hair down for this. <laughs> I'm about to whip my neck out of my adjustment I just had at the chiropractor. <laughs> Anyways, for real, like, I love this poof because it's not too dry, but it's not so weighed down by gel. Like, it's perfect. I absolutely love that. Okay, now we are done, you guys. I hope that you guys enjoyed this. Let me know what you are going to be trying out or what you have been loving. Tell me what I need to try so it can be in my favorites for September. So, I love you guys, but also don't forget that Jesus loves you more. Y'all know he does. And so, I was, and if you haven't already, please go ahead and give me a thumbs up. Also, hit that subscribe button, and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye, guys. Mwah.